we saw this past week as well that they are now getting rid of the Boomerang streaming service, yep. which, of course, is by no means a competitor with any of these other streaming services. But this was a classic streamer that you could stream the old my like, cartoons network yeah, yeah my cartoons, cartoons. yeah and, like there was so many other ones on there that were from my generation too it didn't have to be strictly boomerang there were stuff scattered there from literally all generations right that right pos uh, some of it's going to end up on max but some of it is just not going to go anywhere hopefully they license it out to other streamers to where <coughs> you still can find those cult classic <clears throat> cartoons but sadly, I believe some of them are going to go to the wayside to where you're not going to be able yeah. to find them. And then just like we also saw that they are shutting down the Cartoon Network website. Everybody knows Cartoon Network is the big juggernaut of the television family friendly for Warner Brothers Discovery. But now they're shutting down the website, which I feel like inevitably means they're going to shut down the actual program. So I just don't know how that's going to all go down because are they going to completely yank off Cartoon Network from linear television to where they want you to only watch it on Max or like what yeah. the hell? Yes, that that is because the website was updated. Now if you go to Cartoon Network, it literally says it directs you to Max and that's said crazy. yeah, it it literally directs you to Max. So the last I saw is that Cartoon Network programming that you could ex watch on the website because they had full shows and full episodes that you could watch yeah. on the website because they didn't have a streamer. Um, that's all being removed, and some of that will now end up on Max. Um, yeah. At least currently, and we don't know how long this will last, like you said, all of Boomerang's content is apparently being folded into Max. So, but how long will that be? I I feel like exactly. you're yeah, I feel like you're right. They're gonna weed through a bunch of that, and we're probably gonna end up losing a ton of that content. So between, yeah, this is problematic for me because, like I said, yeah, you're right in the fact that especially Cartoon Network they had a lot of newer kind of you know content and stuff. Yeah. But for me and people my age, Boomerang was the only place that we could find the cartoons that we grew up on. Right? Blue Falcon and Dynama and all the Hanna-Barbera cartoons. Yogi Bear and Hong, Hong Kong Fooey and Super Friends. And, like, anything that if you grew up in the 70s and 80s was on Boomerang. And, and I... If that goes away, what the fuck, man? Because <laughs> it's bad enough you can't wake up on a Saturday morning. And yes, I'm 54 years old. And I still want to wake up on Saturday with a bowl of fucking bad cereal for me and watch cartoons. Okay? I still want to do that. I'm still a kid on Saturdays. And you can't anymore. So the only place that you could is to go to Boomerang or a Cartoon Network to be able to do that. And the idea that these are going away sucks it sucks oh so please don't take super friends away please don't take blue falcon and dynamite the laugh olympics all of that stuff like what are we thinking god damn it zasloff this, ah! um yeah i'm 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 just i'm really worried about warner brothers discovery i i i, I just wish that somebody would come in and do like you know something to save that company and get that man right. out of there because i just feel like it's horribly going in the wrong direction and i think as long as he's at the helm it's going to continue to go in the and here's the thing guys with the stock prices at that price right now i would beg to say that if it drops below five somebody's coming in for a corporate takeover somebody's right, gonna a, a right. corporate raider will come in to to force us a, where's pelts i was just about to say that <laughs> where's, where's pelts, pelts? you, you couldn't him? get disney motherfucker but maybe you could get water but go get him fuck um <laughs> I mean, he says he wanted to save the studio. Well, save Warner Brothers, Pelts. Fucking save right. Warner Brothers then. Uh, stay out of our business, but go get Warner Brothers. Um, so, But all kidding aside, though, anytime any major company drops stock that low, somebody's going to buy that shit up and sell it off. So right. whether De Zasloff does it himself or somebody else comes in to either save it and or chop it up and get rid of it all, it's it's in danger of happening with shares that low. So something has to be done.